Taigi šią savaitę uždirbė rubrikoje Kauno Žalgirio komandos krepšininkas Omaras Samhanas. Hello, man. Hello, how are you? I'm fine, how are you? Good. Omar, first of all, what about the practice? Uh, we have new coach now, so practice has changed. Um, for the third time now, new coach, new practice. So it's uh, we're working hard. We have a lot to change before we can win EuroLeague game. So we're working to change now. So it's it's hard, but good. Do you know that uh, on Sunday uh, was the draw ceremony of European Championship? Yeah, I watched it. You know, I saw a bunch of my teammates were there, so I watched last night. So what's the impression about Lithuanians team? I think they can win. I think they'll win the the whole thing in Europe. I think that they're. I think they will. Uh, there's some good teams, obviously, but it's at it's in Lithuania, which helps. And I I know my teammates are working hard every day, not just for Zalgiris, but also for uh, you know to win the championships in Europe. What about Zalgiris team? You are playing here uh, half of season, yes. And uh, what's the impression about the team, about the city, about the people in uh, in Kaunas, Lithuania? I mean, the thing that, that's uh, not good is in Lithuania, everybody's big basketball fan. And they love basketball, and we have a very good team, and we have very good fans, and it's not good that we have we lose a few games now mm-hmm. because uh, the fans are so good that we they want to see us win, and you know we lose our first two top 16 games. So I think that the Lithuania as a country is very nice, and I go to Vilnius sometimes. Uh, they have Mexican restaurant there, which Lithuanian people don't eat Mexican, but... Americans love Mexicans, so I, I go to Vilnius, but I, I love I love it here. You know, I really like it, and I've got to see a, a lot of countries in Europe, and this is definitely uh, a place I love to play because a lot of people in Europe don't care about basketball like Lithuania does. And what about the United States? You uh, played uh, in other teams. Mm-hmm. Uh, can you compare uh, NBA fans and uh, European Lithuanian? Well, I played I played for the uh, Dallas Mavericks. Uh, in the summer, last summer after university, and uh, in summer league, yes, yes. Mm-hmm. and uh, there were some fans, but not that many. You know, um, our games, every game it, it, of Euro League is crazy. You know, the fans are are very interactive, and I think that their fans in NBA for playoffs are like this, but for Euro League, Zagreb's fans are like this every game. So I say we have the best fans in all of Europe and uh, maybe the world because I think they're better fans than in NBA. Yes, next Wednesday you are going to play in Turkish uh, arena, right? In Istanbul, yes. There will be fifty thousand fans of Turkish team. Are you ready to meet with them? Yes, of course. Um, ready to beat them. Yeah, we need we need to win. We've lost two. Uh, we're zero and two in top sixteen. So we have to win this game and. Uh, It's time to go. Yes. Are you going to play on Wednesday? Do you know? I don't know. I hope so. I Last uh, top 16 game, I guarantee that we win, and then I don't play. So I can't control if we win or not. So yes. it's it's hard not knowing if you play or not. But it's, you know, being a rookie, this is uh, the way it is. So it's hard, but hopefully I'll get a chance to play and play well, and we'll beat Turkey and come home uh, with at least one win in top 16. Maybe it is the thing that the new coach uh, doesn't uh, see you in a team. What is the reason why you're not playing now? Yeah, it's it's up to the coach, you know. Uh, he's the one making the decision, and I don't know. You know, I try to do what I can, and this is third coach, you know, and... Uh, It feels like every time I have to prove myself because I'm rookie. They've never seen me before. They don't know about America and basketball there. They, they've never seen. So I, I have to start all over every time. So it's hard, but hopefully he will think I'll do well in practice and he'll think that I can play in, in, in the EuroLeague game and I'll do well. But it's hard. It's hard. It seems that uh, you are playing better than you played uh, in the start of the season. Uh-huh. What is the reason why that? Yeah, I've gotten a lot more comfortable now, you yes. know, and... Uh, I'm on page now. Like uh, Martinez uh, and me are very good on the court now, and, and Montes too. So I'm uh, I'm getting used to my teammates, and I feel confident now. You know, I, at the beginning of the year, I was a rookie, and it was hard, and I wasn't comfortable. But now I'm comfortable, and I think that I could, you know, have a, a big contribution to the team. You know, we lose Mirza, but I think that we, me and and Bobbin and obviously Travis uh, could could fill this role that Mirza played and, and do better than him. You know, I think we we can. Uh, We can make up for what we lost when Mirza left. Yeah, we are still your weakest size on the court. Um, I think I just need to work on my body more, get stronger, and and you know I'm not going to grow any bigger, but just get stronger and work on jumping and stuff like this, you know. And uh, you are not strong enough. I am, I am, but stronger. You can always be stronger, you know. So uh, hopefully one day we'll see Tel Aviv again, and I want to. I want to be stronger than Sofu, push him around. <laughs> uh, in one interview, you said that uh, the beast is going to make something on the court, yes? Mm-hmm. Uh, maybe it will be in Turkey? If I get the chance, you know, it's hard. I've been waiting to uh, unleash the beast this whole season, and 
every time I think I will, I don't play or whatever. So hopefully I'll get a chance to play and the beast will come out and uh, everybody in Lithuania will know what I'm talking about. I know something about the out of bands. Do you like to make something in, in the kitchen? Or maybe you are a, a good cooker? Uh, I'm not a good cooker, but I, uh, I try my best, you know, and hopefully... If I have a girl over, she can help. A woman can help me make my food with me. But I'm not. I'm not a very good cook. Hey, you have a girlfriend? Uh, no, no. I, I'm looking. I look. You're still looking. <laughs> I'm still looking. In Lithuania. In Lithuania. Oh, yeah, yeah. This avenue, yes. Uh, of course. <laughs> yes. Uh, what could you say about Lithuanian girls? Oh, beautiful. You know, the girls in Lithuania are very beautiful, and uh, I like them very much. So hopefully, hopefully, one of them will like me too. Girls like you. I think so. I don't know. I think so. <laughs> what about your free time activities? Um, Acropolis. <laughs> Acropolis, just Acropolis. I mean, no, I go bowling in Acropolis and watch cinema, and uh, yeah, there's a uh, mega sometimes, you know. But there's not a lot of, of things to do when it snows like this. So I normally go to Acropolis because it's inside, you know. Um, me and uh, DC uh, D Collins, we like to play pool. So sometimes we go to pool hall. Yeah, yeah, he's a very good pool player. So sometimes we go to pool hall, and uh, me and Martinez will go to cinema. So. Yeah. Uh, Mega is near my home. You can meet me. Okay, no problem. Yeah, yes, well. I will be waiting you. <laughs> Something about cars, maybe. You have a car which you want to buy. Uh, well, I can't buy any car here because I crash all the time. <laughs> yeah. This is true story to all the fans. I've crashed three times since I've been here. Zalgiris car. Zalgiris car, three times. <laughs> so, uh, Vladimir says that <laughs> he will just buy me taxi and that I won't drive anymore. So... I must I must have someone else drive me because so I Mark, crash. You should learn to drive. In in California we have no rain, no snow. It's sunny every day, so it's easy. The roads are never slick. Here the roads are icy and they slip. So, uh, but back home in California, I, I have convertible, so mm -hmm. it's I like this very much. So the sun comes in, and yeah. you could never have convertible here. Beast, I hear that uh, the last uh, accident uh, was with Jalgiris player. Yes. Yes. Yeah. This is with Bobbin. You crashed his, his car? No. Oh, I crashed DC car. And Bobbin also. But Bobbin was in it with me, yeah, yeah. So I, I uh... Jesus. I'm a bad driver. The snow, I don't like it. Uh, it was snowing, and I was looking for wipers. Uh -huh. And I looked down, I look up, and boom. Yes, there was in the uh, practice center? Uh, one time was in practice center, and one time was uh, by Acropolis, right when you go under the little bridge, and boom, so... Huge accident. No, not bad, but... Bad enough, you know, it cost me a few hundred liters and I don't have a car right now, so... <laughs> <laughs> and uh, uh, what was the reaction by man who watched that uh, his car crashed Tamar something? He was very mad. Uh, and then when I get out of the car and he knows I'm Zalgiris, he was, he was very nice. <laughs> and he's no problem, no problem. So uh, I pay for his car and he asked for autographs. So I give him autograph and uh, I gave him some, some tickets and everything's okay. <laughs> Omar, music style, mm -hmm. uh, what is your favorite? Uh, I like hip hop, rap. On Le uh, Paltinene? I don't know. <laughs> I know here? I don't know. You know, I, I listen to like Eminem uh -huh. and uh, Lil Wayne and these guys, and I play on the bus. But I sit on the bus, I sit next to uh, Paulus Yankunis and Montes, mm -hmm. and they do not like this music. So a few, few months ago when I come here, uh, right after they win the bronze, They come and uh, I'm playing my Little Wayne and Eminem and they make me turn it off. Mm -hmm. And they play Lithuanian music and you know, I kind of like. So now every now and then on the bus, me and Montes will play Lithuanian music and we dance and sing. But mm -hmm. only only after a win. You know some Lithuanian songs? Uh, no, but when he plays them, I know the, I know them. I don't know what I'm saying, but I know the words. Uh -huh. I don't know what it means, though. So if I uh, would speak in Lithuanian, you... Yep. No, no, I could say it, but I won't know what I say. So in the song, I can sing along, but I don't know what they're saying. Uh -huh. Marcus Brown said that he, he knows Lithuanian anthem. Yes, uh, yes. Also, I'm I think starting to learn, yeah. Have you started to learn Lithuanian? A very little bit, you know, just enough. I can order food and stuff, but uh, not enough. Not enough yet. I want to learn uh, all the way so I can speak, you know, interviews in Lithuanian. Mm -hmm. uh, Omar, you like people's attention. You are going uh, on the street and people is watching you. Uh, yes, of course, of course. And this is no problem. You know, they come, maybe ask for picture or autograph. I have no problem. I, I like, and this is this is job. I mean, it's when you're a basketball player, there's fans, they're going to see you. You know, sometimes guys don't like this. They don't like to be talked to and stuff. And... It's not right. You know, the fans are first, so you have to treat them right. Mm -hmm. Omar, I guess that uh, you don't like everything in Lithuania, yes? There should be some bad points uh, on our country. Of course, it's so cold. Just the weather. Uh, the weather's freezing. This is the worst for me. But uh, besides that, um, 
No, that's it, really. So All maybe you shouldn't uh, walk uh, naked. I know, but there is beautiful woman here, so I come naked so that they see I'm beautiful man. <laughs> maybe there are something uh, what you want to say for our fans, for Zalgiris uh, fans. Of course, of course. I uh, I love the Zalgiris fans, and I know that sometimes they get upset with club. They get upset with team, and they w- Zalgiris fans are funny because they want to win every game, and we want to win every game. But, uh, you know, sometimes this doesn't happen. And, uh, you know, last game they were booing. And, uh, you know, it's it's okay. It's, it's not okay. You know, we need to stay together. And I, I love the fans and I have no problem with them, of course. But uh, stay. I just want them to stay with us, you know, stay support Zalgiris because we will, we will win. You know, we will be a very good team this year. And, uh, of course, we're, we want to win LKL Championship and... Uh, make it to the top eight and mm-hmm. final four and all this stuff. So just just stay with us. And, you know, I know we have a lot of changes and a lot is happening, but let's just, just stay with the team and, and we will all win together. And when we beat Ritas mm-hmm. uh, in the LKL championship, we will all party together. If Ritas offer for you to play in, in Vilnius, mm-hmm. would you agree? Never. They could offer a billion dollars. I never play in Ritas. I don't like them. I don't want to play for them. I play for Zalgiris. As long as I play in Lithuania, I play for Zalgiris or nobody. Ritas is no good. I don't like Ritas, and uh, everybody knows you either are Zalgiris or you Ritas. No, no one else. And I'm Zalgiris, so I don't, I don't like Ritas, and we will beat them for sure. Mm-hmm. No problem. And uh, back to you out of bands about smoking, maybe. Uh, Have you tried that? Smoking cigarettes? Yes. No, but everybody here smokes. It's crazy. Everybody smokes. They leave the bar and they smoke in the cold. It's too cold to smoke. But uh, one night I go to Bara Bara uh-huh. and they have room where people smoke inside the club. Mm-hmm. I never seen this in America, so it was crazy. But uh, yeah, no, I, I know I don't smoke. About the parties in Lithuania. Yes. Uh, I think you should know that uh, Lithuanians uh, have, um, as Russians also, uh, big traditions in alcohol. Yes. 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 You know that from parties. I have seen this. Yes. Uh, And you participated? No, 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 never, never. I party, yes, but I don't drink like Lithuanian can drink like I've never seen. They just drink and drink like all day. Like beasts. No, yeah. Yes, they're beast drinkers for sure. <laughs> But uh, Europe, in America, they don't party like this all night. But in Europe, three, four in the morning, the club is still very popular and, and lots of people. So I will say that Lithuania drink and party harder than America. Which uh, your um, uh, team friend is uh, a good friend for you out of court? Well, of course, uh, Poachers and me are very close. Poachers, you know? yes. Yes, and we're... Where he played in the United States before, and so did I. So we we're both young and stuff. So I, I know Poachers very well. Um, so I would say he's probably the one I hang out with the most, me mm-hmm. and Martinez. Omar, uh, at the practices, I saw that you are a good three point shooter. Why don't you uh, do this on the court, on the on the matches, on the games? Yeah, I I don't know. When I played in uh, NBA summer league, uh, I shot a lot of threes, you know. And uh, but I come, why not here? I come here, and coach tells me he doesn't want so. I just try to do what coach wants me to do. I, I hope that as time goes on and this season, and of course I'm here next season too, so hopefully uh, they will they will allow me to shoot this. You know, I talked to uh, GM and some people and they said, don't worry, you know, eventually we will have you shooting. So I just wait. I wait my turn. At Valencia, uh, we saw you at the starting lineup. Mm-hmm. Is it better for you to, to start the game uh, at the start? Uh, yes, starting? yes. I like it much better because, you know, I warm up and then I'm ready to play, you know, and it's hard when you warm up and then you sit for 10, 15, maybe 20 minutes and then you have to go play. You're cold and it doesn't feel right. But in Valencia, to get out there right away and play, it felt good and I, I thought I played pretty well. I think that's it. Uh, the last thing uh, which I want to, to please you is that you should say uh, which uh, artist and uh, song is your favorite and we will play it on the broadcast. Oh, man. Um, the Black Eyed Peas. Mm-hmm. Uh, what's their new song? The Time of My Life or whatever. Uh, hey, the Time of My Life. <laughs> <laughs> I know, it's a good song. Labas. Che, Omaras, Samhanas, Yus, Kosotes, Zagra, Radio. Davai, davai. Uh, hey, the Time of My Life. <laughs>